Yo, hello everyone and welcome back again to a brand new video. Website builders. Want to integrate Gmail with your Wix websites? You are in the right place. Today, we will walk you through the steps to connect your Gmail account to Wix in 2024. Whether you are managing email subscriptions or receiving inquiries through your website, we will show you how to link your Gmail with Wix. So guys, let's get started. So before we start with this video, make sure to watch it from now till the end so you have the full information. So guys, of course, the first thing that I will need you to have is a Gmail account. So to own a Gmail, you simply have to go to your Google and open Google Chrome as an example. And the first thing that they will ask you for is simply to create or to own a Gmail or to log in with your already existing Gmail account. Now, the second thing is simply to go to Wix. So after going to Wix.com, you simply have to log in. Well, in the login process here, as you can see, there will be a couple of options. So when you try to create an account, this is like the simplest way to actually add your Gmail account. To add your Gmail account within your Wix account, you can simply just log in using it. So you can continue with Google. And as you can see here, you simply have to choose the account and you will be logged in to your account with that specific Gmail account that you have chosen. And with that, you have successfully connected your Gmail account with your own Wix account. But let's say that you want to add some kind of an extension or plugin that will help you to manage to do so. Well, you can go to explore and go to the app markets, as you can see right through here. So by going to your dashboard, log into your account, of course, go to the dashboard and then you go to explore and then the app markets. After you do so, you simply have to search for an apps. So here, Google or Gmail, you can simply go for Gmail instead. And as you can see here, you will be having a lot of like email marketing and stuff so what's you, you the purpose of your basically connection works with your uh, gmail account in case it was simply by sending emails via your gmail account then simply go with this one which is a free to use plugin so let's go for example with it so here it is as you can see these are the main features so you can automatically ex uh, import Wix contacts into the dashboard select contacts you would like to email write subjects and body of the email send emails via your gmail google account to ensure higher de uh, deliverability and make it easier to pry back from your gmail slash google account you can within this actual uh Plugin effortlessly integrate your Wix account directly into your user friendly dashboard, streamlining your communication process with the software you can select, etc. etc. Well, basically, this is what the actual tool is for. Now, for the tool, it is basically here as it seems it is for free so you can have the free plan uh, for the free plan you can only send 15 emails for free every month you can send emails via gmail and also once again import your contacts and land inbox and not spam with the 10 dollar plan in 25 you will have 500 emails per month and unlimited contacts etc uh, get permitted to our chrome extensions and automatically import with contacts in case you would like to go with the 25 dollar per month you will get sent up to 60,000 email every month sent emails via your gmail account and email works contacts which are updated and led inbox and not spam so you could go whatever you want from these so let's add to site as you can see choose whatever website you would like to connect it with this extension so let's go for my site number one and after that I'm going to click on next now we simply have to wait and it's simply going to be integrating within this website now let's click on agree and add and simply now we have given it some kind of permissions that will need to actually start eventually getting the contacts and sending it back to our gmail so here we have added it to our site and it has been added successfully we need to simply now go to the dashboard and check the actual settings of the plugin itself so we simply have now to wait so after going to the apps and click on send emails via gmail we will be here in this area now the account is not logged in already so we have to please log in with google so sign in with google and here we have to actually choose one of the account that we'd like to log in with so for example here I'm going to go with this account to check if it's gonna work there we go continue and let's check what are they going to, need, going to be needing so they will need to select what Salesforce that can access so because you're using sign in with Google Salesforce that will be able to associate you with your personal info on Google see your personal info including any personal info you've made 
publicly available and see your primary account uh, google account email address and make sure you trust Salesforce. you may be sharing sensitive info with the site or app learn how to uh, how Salesforce will handle your data by reviewing its privacy policies etc mm -hmm. so now as you could see we have to simply give them the access by clicking on continue right through here and now we will be able to actually connect it with our email that we have just uh, chosen now uh, in case you would like to simply save all of that as you can see here uh, free package sent today 0 of 10 billing per month 0 of 10 or 50 so here we can simply email subject we can here add the email subjects here we have the contacts so we need to remove all of these and start creating new contact let me just remove that and we need to actually uh, add some context so now how we can add some context the contacts are actually going to be added directly uh, to your uh, to this area just by adding it to your uh, basically Wix website so as long as you have contacts in your Wix website so customers etc go to contacts and basically by adding contacts right here on this page as you can see these are the contacts that I have on, on I had on that page so simply by adding contacts right here you will be sh uh, like adding automatically contacts to that specific app that we have just talked about so now let's go back here let me just go to apps and go to this specific one and now we can simply start using it so we have successfully now connected our gmail with the works website so now we simply have to start using it here just put the email subject here use the body so here the contents of the email and here the subject of the email here choose to whom you would like to send it if you want to send it to every one of these people you simply have to select them all and then click on send email and the email will be sent as long as there is some contents and email subject the email will be sent successfully it's going to be land on the inbox not in the actual uh not in the actual spam folder which is a very very good for you and as you can see zero emails sent you can view them in your gmail sent item folder because zero items is simply because these are uh fake uh, emails as it seems here wix.com so they are fake they are not really uh, used used ones they can't be sent to so in case you have the real emails real contacts you're gonna be able to actually send them these emails successfully without having any issue or any problem so yeah once more you simply have to go to your Wix websites guys you can either simplify everything and just log in with your Google account and that will simply simplify all of this process but in case you had already an account you simply have to go to explore app market search for the specific plugin which is the send emails via Gmail in case you would like to send emails with Gmail and simply connect it and do the same process that we did so guys that was it for today's video I hope you enjoyed it and see you guys in the next tutorial bye bye